like somebody with a really good psychic. Uh, there's a lot of power you can generate, um, but that also means we can use that power against the partner as well. So I borrow your foot, so beautiful, push it here. When the foot's a little bit more towards this side of the body, if I bring my hands down, this hand's closest. So when I'm doing my body defense, which is this, I can use my hand to get some torque to rotate and scoop at the same time. So it's coming towards me, there. So I've got a strong body and hand defense, but if I don't do something very carefully, Andy might very quickly try to start to spin, and strike, follow up, something horrible like this. So I need to change his mindset. And the timing I'm gonna use, before his foot hits the floor, I need to create a strike to somewhere vulnerable. In the moment, it'll probably be towards the back of Andy's head. So it's the kick's coming towards him here. Striking on some checking. There's my kick running away. Now the Scooby-Doo run is option, optional. <laughs> so again, because it's closer, just slowly, that's it, to this hand, this is the one I'm gonna scoop with. But if it's more this side, or I'm more over here, yeah, that's the problem. This hand will start to scoop. And again, don't look at that. Yeah, bring it up, watch it. So, if pushing against, feel into that. When I bring my hand down, it's touching. It's a body defense, as soon as possible, I'm going into attacking mode, nice and relaxed. So, from here, extending, fighting, I'm boxing. And the way of moving. Cool. So this side, if it's scooping this side, closest to this leg. This hand, if it's closer to this side, it's scooping with this hand. And if it's going to the leg low, it's another technique. Thanks, okay. guys.